Welcome to the Aegis Secure Key 3.0 instructional series, Section 3, Changing the Admin Pin and Deleting or Changing the User Pin. They're all related, but remember that two of these three actions are done in Secure Key 3's admin mode, with the exception of changing the user pin, which can only be done in the user mode. So, let's go ahead and start with that one. First, press the unlock button to wake the key. Then, enter the user pin and press unlock again. The green LED will blink indicating that it's unlocked. Now, press and hold the unlock button and the one button together until the red LED starts blinking. Re-enter the current user pin and press the unlock button. The green LED will now blink and the blue LED will glow steadily. Now, enter the new user pin and press the unlock button. The green LED will blink by itself for a few seconds and then it will be joined by the steady blue LED. One more time, enter that new user pin and then press the unlock again to confirm it. That user pin is now changed. Okay, for the tasks of deleting a user pin or changing the admin pin, we have to first put the secure key 3 into the admin mode. Let's start over and press the lock button to get going. Now, press the unlock button to wake the key up. Then, press and hold the unlock and the zero button until the red LED starts blinking. Now enter your admin pin and press the unlock button once more. The steady blue LED indicates we're now in the admin mode. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with how we delete a user pin. Press and hold the 7 and 8 button until the green LED blinks three times, and then let go of those buttons. When the red LED and the blue LED start to blink alternately, go ahead and press and hold the 7 and the 8 buttons together for another 5 seconds or so until the green LED glows steadily, and then let those buttons go. The green LED goes out and the blue LED comes back on indicating that the user pin is now deleted and the secure key is still in the admin mode. If you'd like, you can add a new, different user pin at this time, or you could leave it empty for a later addition. Okay, so while we're still in the admin mode, let's go ahead and cover how to change the admin pin. Obviously, this operation can only be done from the admin mode. So, press both the unlock button and the 9 together. The blue LED will now be joined by the green LED blinking. Enter your new admin pin and press the unlock button. The green LED will blink three times. Now enter that new admin pin once more and press unlock one last time and there you have it. The green LED will glow steadily for a few seconds, then it will be replaced by the blue LED glowing steadily, and you're back in the admin mode with a new admin pin. Well, there you go. Thanks for watching and check out our other instructional videos on the Aegis Secure Key 3 at apricorn.com.